What happened? She found out and kicked his. <laughs> she found out and divorced him. No, I found out that she was cheating with the, her with the wife, his wife. With the husband. With yeah, that's it. She was cheating with the husband. With the husband. Of the, yeah. <laughs> yep. Or she had an affair with the wife. Oh, no, no, no. Wait a minute. Well, that's her girlfriend, too. Ooh. <laughs> I can't believe I said that one. Wow. All right. Let's go ahead and get into it and see which one of these soap opera theories they just threw out is right. You're selfish. Six year affair and it was only not worth it because you and affair partner were caught. Not only do you not deserve your wife, but you do not deserve your affair partner. Update. I was prepared for all scenarios, but not this one. The doom day did not come in the shape I was expecting. A fair partner convinced her soon-to-be ex to not spill the beans to my wife in exchange for a smooth divorce. I thought I was in the clear. Yesterday, a fair partner sent me a blurry photo of my wife in the car with another man. She claimed they walked hand-in-hand -hand to his car from a store in a nearby town to ours. She got a shot of the plates too. After some digging, I now know that she's having an affair. Don't know how long for sure, but at least for six months. He's a single dad, our age, and is telling her to leave the marriage. She's telling him that she loves him. I'm afraid to confront her. I feel numb at this point. Took a day off of work. Any advice on how to proceed? Should I just let it run its course and monitor? Should I confront and hope for the best? Should I confess to my affair and hope that we can all come clean and make way for a new marriage? I'm so utterly confused. I have rehearsed the things that I would say and do if she were to find out about my affairs. I was not prepared for this. I think you need to find out why your wife cheated. If her reasons line up with yours, maybe there's a way for you to move to don't ask, don't tell. OP. I'm desperate to talk this out to know why this happened and how invested she really is with this jerk. If she's doing this out of revenge, maybe I have a chance, because if so, she does feel something for me at least. I can't imagine her being emotionless, throwing away over 20 years. I know this woman like I know myself. Deep down, she's hurt, but also so very stubborn and proud. I just want to know if she knew about my affair, why didn't she confront me? I would have chosen her over a fair partner in a nanosecond. And what is she hoping to find with this guy? He's no better than me, hooking up with a married woman. Ugh. I'm trying to respect her wish to have some space, but I'm desperate to just talk to her. Update. My marriage seems to be over. Confronted my wife this past weekend, set her down without warning, and told her I knew she was having an affair and with whom. Asked her if she loved him and what her plan was. She was caught off guard, went to the bathroom for 10 minutes. When she came out, she looked me straight in the eyes and said, I know about your affair too. I've known for some time now. I love him and I want a divorce. Next days were a blur. I tried talking to her, but she just shuts me down. She has moved into the spare bedroom and is making appointments with law firms. Has told our two daughters, I have signed up for emergency therapy. I'm on meds for dealing with anxiety and a lack of sleep. This is surreal. Heard her talk to him last night and cut the internet cord. Kind of crazy because I need internet for work and she just switched to her phone. Oh man, so many emotions are running through me. How did this happen? How can she not feel any emotion? Over 20 years, gone. All the love, friendship, partnership, intimacy, jokes, memories, plans for our future, gone. Just like that. No looking back. I feel so blindsided, and the only person I can talk to is my brother who lives across the country. Sorry to vent to you here. Just needed to get this out. <laughs> oh, so now, now I think we've slipped over into not real... And the reason why is because this sounds like the perfect cautionary tale uh, that someone would write. You know what I mean? Like, this is just, like, too perfect. But mm. it's very much how human behavior is. You know, and it, now here's a generalization. Men oftentimes will cheat because, one, they have a weak personal code of conduct, which is, I, I always say, I always say, you don't cheat on your partner you actually are cheating on your, your own morals, like your own core. Mm -hmm. So if you have a weak moral compass, then you cheat as a guy, you cheat because the opportunity presents itself. Oftentimes, now women can do the same thing. 
But oftentimes men are on men are like more likely to cheat because of opportunity, not because of affection. Women are often more likely to cheat because of affection, not because of opportunity. So if she's been in this relationship for an extended period of time, she's already emotionally shut off this dude. Like yeah. that's that's done. You know what I mean? So uh -huh. one, I don't think it's real anymore. And two, I don't care what happens to cheaters. I'm actually one of those people that would be like on some uh the Philippines type shit, like, you know, you you can get you can you can get X'd out far as I'm concerned. So good luck to all of them. Whatever. Anna? I'm gonna go with this this is a basis in reality, but definitely some additions and Mm. Yeah, I'm sorry I can't pull up much investment in this. It, it, I agree with Mickey. It sounds like the wife she knew about it for a long time. She emotionally checked out of the relationship when yep. found somebody who actually saw her. Yep. And you know what? You do you, boo. If that's a real thing, you, you do you. Good. Good for you. This guy's like you're muted, Diaz. Oh, I'm sorry. I said no, nah, she's just as bad because cheating is always a choice. She could have left too. So yeah. she mm -hmm. chose to take this particular path. He chose to take this particular path. Own your actions, own your decisions. Yeah. You're a lying cheating bitch too. He's a lying cheating bitch. Everybody's a lying mm -hmm. cheating bitch. Yeah, so, yeah. Go find your lion cheating bitch life and hope that none of this catches back up with you and somebody you know causes harm to you. 